Listen closely and you can still hear the echoes from Sunday's game at Subaru Park. In front of a packed crowd, the Union sealed the win when the game went to penalty kicks. Just incredible. Chris has been a season ticket holder since the Union first took the field in Chester in 2010. He was there Sunday as his team went deeper into the playoffs than they ever have before in their 12-year history. This is the biggest ever, yeah. We've never had December soccer in Chester. We will have it this Sunday against New York City FC. It got really cold as the sun dropped, and uh, but everybody was just charged up, and most of the time you're standing. I mean, you are literally standing almost the whole game. You're chanting. From the word dupe on everything, which refers to the song played after each goal. <laughs> Union fans are nuts, and in a very good way. The Sons of Ben crew packs the riverside of the stadium. They wear their team on their skin, on their cars, on their license plate. They get them started early. Many diehard soccer fans can never understand why everybody else isn't a diehard soccer fan, but they're hoping this year's exciting Union playoff run might inspire more people to come out to the stadium in the future. It's not going to happen this weekend, though. The place is already going to be jam-packed. Sunday's game, absolutely the hottest ticket in town. On StubHub, the cheapest standing room tickets I found were about 120 bucks a piece. Some seats at midfield are going for about 400 bucks. The place can hold around 19,000 fans. It's just amazing how everybody was energized. Chris was there last Sunday and he'll be there this Sunday, hopefully pushing the union onto the championship game. But first things first, dress warm on Sunday, go to Chester, make lots of noise. Oh, I, I can't wait. I can't wait to beat New York. Yeah. In Chester, Tim Furlong, NBC 10 News.